Hey, what's Chloe here? And today's video is going to be a Facebook Q and A. Now, there are going to be a bit different questions, I guess. I'm not asking my subscribers for these questions. I'm actually asking random people off Facebook for these questions. So basically, there is a page on Facebook called Melbourne Gal Pals. Shout out to the page. I don't know if you guys watch my videos, but you know I share it a lot on the page. And there's over 30,000 girls in the page. It's only girls, no boys, nothing. And it's just a tight-knit community of just a bunch of girls asking for advice, help, blah, blah, blah. So I decided to post a video of me asking for questions. And we got some responses back. I want to do a massive shout out to everyone in the Melbourne Gal Pals. If you're watching this from Melbourne Gal Pals, I love you all. I have made so many friends from this group and I love it so much. So if you are featured in this video, thank you for asking me some questions and let's get on to the Q&A. Okay, so let's get on to this Q&A. And if I do pronounce your names wrong, I so, so apologize. I'm the worst with pronunciation and oh my God, I hate it. So. I do apologize. So the first question I have is from Georgia Redmond. Redmond? I'm sorry. I love Georgia. She, I love her. She's a queen. Um, and her question is, what camera do I use? I use the Canon 600D. So I use the Canon EOS 600D. I love it so much. And I'm currently, it's connected to my laptop, which I can see my face on the laptop. So it's easier without using the viewfinder, me looking at the viewfinder for half the freaking video, because I always do that. So. This camera is amazing. I don't know where I got it from because I got it for a Christmas present from both my parents and my brother. Yeah, so that is the camera I use and I use the lens that came with the camera. So the camera comes with obviously the camera by itself, a miniature lens and then a larger lens for like zooming in for photos. Um, I, they purely got me this for my photography love because I love photography. But um, I started using it for YouTube and yeah <laughs> so that is the camera i use so thank you georgia for your question the next question comes in from tamara Han hagen i'm so so sorry her question is what made you start a youtube channel this is a very long answer so basically i started this channel in 2011 i think oh my god and i was just a lover of singing and doing like just music stuff so i posted that first and I did like a bunch of makeup stuff. I was shit at makeup, just saying. <laughs> and I kept posting that and I obviously got hate for it. So I took it all down. If you want this entire story, I can do that. Like my YouTube story, I can do that. But yeah, so basically I took all my videos down and I used my YouTube as a YouTube for like other people, like watching people listen to music and all that. And then I decided to do it again in year seven. So my first ever year of high school. No, that was the worst decision of my entire life because it, the whole school knew and they just kept bullying me, blah, blah, But anyways, um, so I took it down again. I actually eventually had to leave the school because it got so bad. After I got this camera, like maybe a year or so after, I'm like, I'm going to do it again. So I started it again and now we're here. So I basically started it to show, I don't know, my voice. I thought I was a good person. Like I thought I would have like the best boys ever. I thought I was like a devil or some shit. No, I'm really not. So um, yeah, I started that because I wanted to show my voice. Basically, I wanted to be famous for my voice. Um, yeah, so basically I wanted to be famous. Mind you, this was in 2011. I'm almost 18 now. It's 2016. So yeah, it's like five years ago. Oh my God, that was five years ago. Oh my god. Holy oh shit. That's what made me want to do it back then. But I wanted to start it again like professionally like this because I just thought why not? Because I've always loved filming and I've always loved editing. Like I love doing it. And I just thought why not do it again? I've I've legit gained like over maybe 90 subscribers since December and I Oh my god. I'm sorry, that makes me really emotional. Oh my god, but anyways, yeah, so I just basically wanted to do it because I wanted to show people that you can do YouTube, you can do what you love, and if you want to do YouTube, do YouTube. It's so much fun. Thank you, Tamara, for your question. If I mispronounce your name, I am so sorry. 
The next question I have is from Paige Alice, and her question is, where, or what do you see yourself doing in five years' time? Oh, Jesus. So in five years' time, I will be 23. God. Um, I see myself continuing YouTube. Hopefully, I have a bigger fan base. Um, hopefully, I can, like, change people's, like, lives. You know, like, those YouTubers, a bunch of you just have changed my life. Like... I can tell you that right now, like they've changed my life and just me watching them through a screen. And I want to be that person one day, like it's not for the money, it's not for, you know, the views or whatever, it's for me changing the person's view on something or just their life in general. And I want that to be me one day. So hopefully in about five years, like she stated, I'll see myself doing that and have a bigger fan base. Um, in maybe five years, I'll be a professional makeup artist, I can do people's makeup. 23 is, I don't know, me at 23 you could get married probably, <laughs> but like I just find, find love, blah blah blah, all that cheesy little shit, um, but yeah, that's basically where I, I want to see myself in five years, but basically the big fan base is what I want in five years to change people's lives, not for the money, not for the views, just to change people's lives. So thank you Paige for that question. Okay, so we have two, three questions from Taylor Ritchie. And thank you, girlfriend, for all of these questions. So the first one she wrote was, what career path are you wanting to follow? YouTube and makeup artistry, I think, will probably be my top two. Um, I don't know which order they'd go in, but those are my top two, like, dream careers I want to follow in the future. Oh my god, she's commenting like heaps. Oh my god, I love you, girlfriend. <laughs> she's like, how long does it take you to edit your YouTube videos? Oh, oh my god. Okay, it depends on the video. So if it's a longer video, it takes forever. It takes longer to upload the videos rather than to edit them because my Wi-Fi is so shit here. But to edit them, I'd say for a full video in one day, three to four hours in one day, maybe five. But usually I do it over a course of days and I'm not gonna film I'm not gonna edit it all in one go. Nick it's tutorials here on YouTube films and then edits and uploads. I was like Girl, like how? But yeah, that's basically what I do. That's what about five hours top if I'm doing it in a day. So yeah. But usually I spend I spread it out over like three days, two days. So yeah. Um Taylor's bringing in the questions over here, so thank you, girlfriend. Um how do you prepare for a YouTube video? Oh God, um, I have to put makeup on, like I just have to. Usually if I'm putting on makeup, I usually film it. So if I'm doing a tutorial, I usually film it and then film other videos. So I filmed this look today, so you'll probably see that whenever. Um, but I usually film my makeup. If not, I just do a very simple look. I don't know if you guys noticed that, but I usually just use like mascara or something. I don't go all out. I don't know, is that weird? I don't know. Um, preparing isn't that hard. I just set my laptop up, camera, all that shit. I don't mentally prepare for it because I have a whole list of ideas. So like, you know what I mean? Yeah, dream guy. Ooh, dream guy. Um, why does Dylan O'Brien come to my head? <laughs> He's, oh. oh, Dylan O'Brien is my dream guy. A dream guy that loves my family and loves me and you know basically he has to love my family like there's no in between on that it has to love my family like he just has to and last question from taylor is do you do you like a five facts about me you wouldn't know okay five facts about me you wouldn't know you don't know anything about me though um i do sing i've been singing since i was like a kid like legit like five um i've been doing makeup since i was 11 or 10 years old 11 years old i'm now 18 basically <laughs> i have an older brother Yay! Um, you don't really see him often because he doesn't really like to be in videos, but I do have an older brother. I left school to pursue my YouTube and makeup career, I guess. I left year 12 to do that. <laughs> um, oh, number five. Um, 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 um. I have a cat. Mm. Yes, that's my five facts about me. Oh my god. <laughs> Oh, we have another question from Georgia. Georgia asked me what camera do I use before and she just asked me what lighting do I use. I use natural lighting. I don't use any artificial lighting. I use natural lighting. So right now it's all the sun and usually, what am I doing this for? Usually Australia is very, very sunny or either really cloudy, but usually if it's cloudy and cold, there's usually some type of light coming in. So I'm legit 
sitting at my makeup desk and the window is right there so I use natural lighting. A lot of YouTubers do use artificial lighting as well as natural lighting but if I need to in the future I'll probably get some artificial lighting, use that, blah blah. Like it annoys me because I can't film at night. Like if I have an ID I have to wait, like you know what I mean? But yeah, I use natural lighting, Georgia, so thank you for your question. And a question from Erin Pitchford. She says, favorite YouTubers. Mm, my god, oh my god. <laughs> this is gonna be a long ass freaking bloody question. So basically, um, all of the people I met at Amplify Live, so Keen and JC, all of them beautiful people back there, all of them. If you haven't seen my Amplify video, please go check it out. Link will be in the description somewhere. Um, Nikki Tutorials, Jeffree Star, Manny MUA. Oh my god, I'm gonna cry. I fucking love Manny. Oh my god. Um, Shane Dawson, uh, Kata Potato, you queen, girlfriend. Like all the O2L boys. Remember O2L? Oh my god, I remember O2L. Oh my god. <laughs> um, yeah. Basically everyone. <laughs> That's really bad to say, but basically everyone. Uh, beauty people, um, and then comed comedic people, I guess. Yeah, pretty much. Yeah. So thank you, Erin, for your question. And basically, the other, qu the most questions I got were from Georgia and Taylor. So they're the same people, but I hope that's okay. Like I don't care. I love them for. The question so thank you <laughs> okay so George's other question she asked me was my favorite food oh my god um favorite food oh my god nachos oh some good off some nachos and chips and gravy but they have to be like great gravy and like the perfect chip. Oh, I'm so picky oh my god but yeah mostly but, uh, mostly chips and gravy are like my top top oh ugh, mm, love oh my god the other question she asked me was, how do you how do you make your makeup look so bloody good? Girl, I love you so much. Oh my god. I just did pra I practice after practice after practice. So basically, I started at the age of 10 to 11, as I said before. People might think, oh my god, that's like so bad. But basically, my older cousin actually, shout out to you, girl. I don't know if you watch me, but I love you. Um, I was basically a model because she practiced on me because we have the same face shape same like brows eyes whatever we have the same face shape and everything so she practiced on me and obviously if I see what she's doing I'm learning and I started doing it on myself I started doing it on her and I just practice and practice and practice like I pr legit I put on makeup just for the fun of it to practice I'm not even kidding like I've wasted so many products because I practice so much with them and just practice girlfriend that's basically it another question georgia asked and i think this is the last one she asked she was like lush products you use i don't use that much lush products but if i do go to lush i either get basic bath bombs or a face mask the face mask i use is mask of magnanimity i love it so much i did do a lush haul of me like showing you the products so just go check that out it's like my second third video maybe Basically, I, I buy the stuff that the Lush workers recommend me because I don't know what I'm looking for. I don't know what's good and what's not. So I always just get what they're recommending and it, usually it's the best thing ever. But I usually don't take baths. I usually take showers. So, yeah. <laughs> Last question Georgia asked was favorite alcohol beverage. I have never drunk an alcoholic beverage. I'm 18 in October and I'm very excited. But like, I don't think I'm going to drink that much anyway, but I am not legal yet in a show you have to be 18 and over to drink. I think in America you have to be 21. Anyways, but yeah, girlfriend, it's good, it's good. <laughs> but thank you, Georgia, for all your questions. Again, if I'm mispronouncing your name, I'm so sorry, um, but I love you. <laughs> so the rest of the questions are from Taylor. Thank you so much, Taylor. So, Taylor firstly wrote, who inspires you? Who inspires your makeup looks? Oh, I usually do not copies of other people, but like just inspiration from other YouTubers, other photos I see, celebrities, or if not, I'm just messing around and want to try new palettes, new like eyeshadows, and just put them all on my face and just try new ones. Like I just experiment. I usually take bits and pieces of other people's like work and put them into mine and maybe change up the colors or change up the techniques. I don't copy them. If I do, I would say that, like I'm using them as inspiration. But basically, YouTubers, celebrities, or 
myself. <laughs> Next question she said was go-to makeup. It's what I'm wearing right now. I did film this today, guys, so you'll see this. This is my daily makeup routine. I wear this mostly every day, and if I don't want to wear thick, bold liner, I usually just put on mascara. But this is my go-to look, and it will be up soon. I think it's going to be up before this, so if it is, go check it out, because I'm pre-filming a lot, so I don't know. But go check it out if it is already uploaded. She's like, fit, face care routine. Oh, God. I'm thinking of doing a skincare routine, so I'm not going to go through it all now because I will do it in the video. So give this video a thumbs up if you do want to see a skincare routine because I do a lot to my face. So, yeah. Taylor also says favorite makeup brand. Oh, probably NARS. I know NARS is a bit expensive, but I think NARS is probably my favorite. Um, oh, my God. Uh, Urban Decay, maybe as well and Too Faced. They're my top three, I guess. And obviously drugstore brands as well, but yeah. Next question she wrote was, how did you learn to do your makeup techniques? Again, from my cousin, I watched her do it on me with a mirror and she also talked while she was doing it on my face. So I obviously learned from such a young age, but right now I'm learning obviously more techniques and that's usually from YouTube videos and makeup gurus on YouTube, like YouTube tutorials. Also Manny, also Jeffrey, I'm like learning so much from those three people and I love them so much. They're my top three beauty people and I adore them, like, oh my god. The next question she wrote was pineapple on pizza. I don't like pineapples on pizza. Just saying, um, I don't like pineapples in general and yeah, I don't want it on my pizza, so that's a no-no for me. And the last question we have from Taylor is dream holiday destination. Oh, okay, so my dream holiday is to tour Europe, Hawaii, and New York. That is my three. Like, I, oh, oh my god. I'm, mm. So, guys, that is the end of this Facebook QA. I hope you guys enjoyed this. And if you did ask me a question from Melbourne Gap House, thank you so much. If you want me to do this more, give it a thumbs up. And if I gain more subscribers, I can obviously do subscriber, Twitter, Instagram. Snapchat questions. If you do want to ask me any questions for further Q&As, please leave them on Twitter, Instagram, Snapchat. All of those are in the description box down below. And a shout out, a massive, massive shout out to Melbourne Gal Pals. I love you all so much. Thank you for being so nice to me about my YouTube career and everything. So I love you all. Spread love, stay positive, and I'll see you guys in my next video. Bye, guys. So, guys, that is the end of this Q&A with my Facebook fans. No. I have never drunk, drank, drunk. <coughs> Let me check if that's a 600 day. Yeah, so I use it. <laughs> ax, 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 accent? What? I. Expert. What? I usually take. What? So, guys, that is. What? <laughs> You're driving me.